Hey guys, today we're going to look at a couple of Marshall speakers. These are the latest entries into Marshall's galaxy of portables, the Emberton 2 and Whelan. Both blessed with Marshall's iconic aggressive vinyl and brass style, something that's become associated with this brand. They also stuck with that one brass control knob that does everything from power, volume, music playback controls. I mean, this control scheme is just easier compared to having multiple buttons for different controls. And it's something you don't get with other brands. There's also a new feature called Stack Mode. Basically, you can daisy chain any number of Ambertons and Willens to spread your audio across a wider area. So you can have one in the kitchen, one in the study, another in the bedroom, all playing the same music as long as they are within Bluetooth range. Let's you set the same mood throughout the house. Also, they both now support multi-point pairing. This lets you connect both models to two different mobile devices at the same time. So if you prefer, you can pause your music on one device and seamlessly start playing your music from the other. There is no need to go into the device Bluetooth settings to unpair and repair the speaker. Another unique element that people have come to expect from Marshall products is its heavy sound signature. This means deep, heavy bass with a lot of gravity. This is something we're going to test later during the sound demo. And I recommend listening to this video with headphones because the samples are recorded using binaural microphones. By the way, guys, I've split this video into chapters. So if you want to, you can simply navigate to the parts you're interested in. First, we have the Emberton 2. I've looked at the first Emberton and wow, that was a treat in terms of sound and style. Now, this one, takes things even further. It's got bigger battery of up to 30 hours of playtime. It's got an IP67 rating. Now it also comes with app support. The Marshall app brings over the air updates as well as the ability to customize the Emberton sound with EQ presets. You've only got three presets to play with and there isn't a graphic EQ, but for such a product that is meant more for casual background listening, Anything more than that is simply overkill. The Willen is meant to be a more compact, carry everywhere speaker. The main focus here is portability. So it's got a strap at the back. I can see this being strapped to bags, belts, anywhere you could possibly want a speaker to be at in that particular moment. It's got all the features of the Emberton, including app support, EQ presets. The only differences are that it's got a smaller battery of up to 15 hours of playtime, just a single two inch full range driver instead of the Emberton's dual two inch setup and a built in microphone. Now, this is so that you can use this as a hands free speaker for phone calls. When I was testing the microphone, it seem to perform better if you are about three to six feet away. That means about one to two meters. If you're nearer, it picks up the echo of the room. Otherwise, it sounds pretty good for a built-in mic. Here's how it sounds. I'm now making a phone call in a quiet place using the Marshall Willen. Now I'm very close to the speaker. I'm going to move backwards. Can you hear me? Can you hear me? Can you hear me? I'm now about, I'd say, two meters away from the speaker. Again, this is the Marshall Willen. Moving back in front of the speaker, closer and closer and closer. Right now, we're going to test the sound quality side by side with a couple of tracks. Now, these have got what Marshall describes as its signature sound. So I'm expecting heavy, rich, deep bass with a lot of gravity. Do they both have that or only the bigger speaker? This is something we're going to find out. First, something groovy with male vocals and bass guitars. Now, listen out for the richness in the bass and how separated the background singer's vocals are from the main tracks. Stop. 
I kind of liked the Emberton sound more, track separation was cleaner, the sound staging sounded more airy, and there was a lot more heaviness, more oomph in its bass response, which made it sound more groovy. The Willen has a more compact sound, and it had a lot more emphasis in the lower and upper mids, rather than the bass. Separation was not as clean as the Emberton's because it is relying after all on that single 2-inch driver. However, its vocals do sound brighter than the Emberton's, which makes it more ideal for listening to podcasts, news, talk shows, anything to do with vocals. So if I had both speakers, I would definitely use the Emberton for background music and watching movies. The Whelan, I will use for podcasts. Now let's listen to another track, something with more strings, this time by a female vocalist. To conclude, both of these models are compact and portable, but I can see them fulfilling different roles. If you want something that's much easier to carry about, something lightweight, got a strap, sounds decent, built-in hands-free microphone, that's the villain. Definitely for the seasoned traveler, the backpacker, for more serious, casual listening that isn't necessarily something you want to bring outside, but is still something that can wear many hats, be it a music system, bigger sound for watching videos, movies, mobile gaming. That's the Emberton. Now, personally, I would pick the Emberton. I think it meets my needs better in terms of sound and my particular use case as the exact opposite of a backpacking, active lifestyle guy. Yep have been trying to change that small baby steps. If there is one criticism I have about both speakers, it's that they both don't have a 3.5mm auxiliary input, so if you want to save battery or connect a traditional source that does not have Bluetooth, it is not possible to connect it to these speakers. So yep, that's my only criticism of the Emberton 2 and the Whelan. Otherwise, both of them, they sound great, and I'm sure many people will find them useful for different use case scenarios. But what do you guys think? Which one will you pick? The Emberton 2 or the Whelan? Let me know in the comments. Thanks for watching. Smash like and share if you like this video. If you want to see more content from me, from this channel, get subscribed and tap the bell button to stay notified whenever I release new videos. A big shout out to my Patreon supporters as always. You can also join us on the world's most popular gaming chat app, Discord. If you want to hang out or chat, link is in the box down below. Click here to check out some cool earbuds from Marshall or watch another video from this channel.